Hi, my name's Andy Wolf. This is my video on arthroscopic capsular plication of the hip. This is done when patients exhibit mild to moderate hip instability, which can come from multiple sources. First, a little anatomy. The hip joint is stabilized by its fibrous capsule, which has three focal thickenings. In the front of the hip, the thickening known as the iliofemoral ligament is a primary restraint against external rotation and extension of the hip. Just beneath the iliofemoral ligament is the pubofemoral ligament, and towards the back of the hip there is the ischiofemoral ligament. Most commonly it is the iliofemoral ligament which is cut and then shifted or plicated in order to provide additional stability to the front of the hip. The arrows demonstrate the vector in which the capsule will be shifted once the plication is complete. The sutures are passed and then are tied on the outside of the hip capsule in order to complete the plication. This is a patient in whom I've already performed a labor repair and corrected her impingement. I have cut the iliofemoral ligament portion of the capsule and now will close it in a tighter manner by passing these sutures through it. They are passed through the capsule in a way that will tighten the capsule ultimately when they are tied. I typically will put three to four sutures in. In this patient I'm placing three sutures which I then tie on the back side of the capsule. This is what it looks like after the sutures have been tied and their tails cut. The capsule is now not only fully closed, but also tightened or plicated. Thank you for watching. For more information, please visit my website at www.andrewwolfmd.com.